preparation for this happened on a very unusual location. You might think it would be on the plains of Montana, but it was actually on the beach of Jekyll Island off the coast of Georgia. While I was there, I actually did a, a little watercolor sketch of it. The sky is all open expanse, and like I say, it's, it's empty the way it should be. So it has all the space it needs to be a sky. Plan, the building plan of this painting is all gray, lack of color, and then concentrate color in one little spotlight, which would be inside the teepee, the fire, and the liner. There's a sheet of canvas or, or skin the time that would be tied to each of these lodge poles. And then more often than not, they would decorate them. It gives a little stories about what some of the conquests, some of the hunts, some of the battles that were fought. Kind of the life story. A little more symbolic than, than normal, but if you notice, there's two bison going one way, two horses going the other way, and they're both looking at them. So it was just my way of, the way he would talk it. He would say, this particular campaign that we went on to steal horses from the neighboring tribe. And this is what happened. This is how great I was. And then there would be particular buffalo hunts where he did some wonderful things too and wants everyone to know his little autobiography or his diary of how great he is. Another thing to remember is the lodge, the teepee, didn't belong to the men at all. The teepee, the lodge, the home belonged to the woman. She controlled everything. He did get the, the rights to decorate. By herself, take this down, fold it, have the lodge folds down, stacked, and being pulled away by horses in, in an hour. So you can totally close this off to the weather just by moving these poles around. I had the, the lodge pole extended a little bit, and then for some reason I had just done the little line that, that flew off. Well, it became so apparent that that should be a magpie with a magpie tail. Everything in here is anchored to the earth except the magpie.